the point is that we may want to have place restrictions on things people are allowed to do with that program. But if those restrictions are justified, then they are not justified only for one program. In order for them to be justified, there has got to be a powerful reason that would apply to any program that could do those same things. And it should be adopted by governments, democratically legislated, not simply proclaimed by a business and imposed on society. So if we want, and I think we should have, some laws about what you're allowed to do with certain computer programs, we should make them general enough that they apply regardless of which program you might use. And we should not let businesses decide what they say. We must not farm out legislation to powerful businesses. They have no right to have that power. <clears throat> Consider, for instance, fraud. Fraud is wrong. It's wrong whether it's carried out using a pen and paper or with a text editor, with an email client, whatever. And in fact, it's prohibited regardless of those details because the crime is fraud. The crime is not misuse of a text editor or misuse of email or misuse of a pen. And that's the way it should be. It means that we don't need to update the law against fraud to apply specifically to all the programs you might use to commit fraud with. They're all covered because those details are irrelevant to that law. And that law was not decided by a company. It's not imposed on us by a company that everyone feels it's inevitable to be a customer of. We should do the same thing with any abuse of digital technology, which is bad enough it needs this kind of correction. It should be done by laws that are general, not associated with the release of any particular program, and not a matter for the developer of the program to choose. The developer should not have the power to impose such restrictions at all. Only governments with the power to legislate should be allowed to do that because with governments we can have democracy, but businesses will never be governed by our votes. <clears throat> <clears throat>